Coming up, uh, maybe you made a New Year's resolution to have your family cut down on all that screen time. And maybe you're finding it's easier said than done. We'll talk about the benefits of shutting off your devices after the break. Technology, it seems almost impossible to escape screens and texting and all this social media, especially for kids. Well, we're talking to Nicole Runyon, who's a psychotherapist, and Justin Tromley. He is a teacher, second grade teacher at the Detroit Waldorf School. Why it's so important to cut down on screen, t screen time. Okay, first of all, Waldorf School, I understand, in Indian Village, small, I guess, private school. Is that true? Correct, yes. All right, Nicole, what's the problem with kids and the social media these days? Well, there's a lot of things going on, but one of the more important things to be concerned about is the addictive nature of the screens. It is addictive, it's, isn't it? It's extremely addictive. In fact, studies are showing that the same areas in the, of the brain that get lit up with winning money and drinking alcohol are getting lit up with screens. All right, so um, Justin, you're, you teach second grade. Yes. Second graders don't have cell phones, do they? Absolutely not. And in fact, in the school oh. as a whole, we don't have computers or technology. No computers? No. You, you teach handwriting? You don't teach Absolutely. handwriting in this school, do oh, you? Oh, yes, we teach handwriting. What? Yep, we teach a lot through physical activity, music, uh, movement, and um, imagination. And we're finding that when you bring a screen into the classroom, really, you're cutting off that imagination for the children and cutting them off from one another. Now, some people may argue, though, that with the with a, within my hand, I have every bit of knowledge I could possibly have by just Googling a couple little things. Doesn't that help kids, you know, expand their knowledge? I think that it's important to look at the age in which we expect kids to use this for their education. I think in terms of development, we don't want to give them a phone too early because we're then encouraging some sort of addictive response to it. Well, and this so, has got to be an age then. I, I believe that as a, as a specialist in child development. Um, what, what age is good to buy the kid their first self smartphone? I, I think sometime around high school, sometime ninth nice. grade, 13, 14 years old. In reality, though, what is it, though, Justin? Much younger. Yeah. yeah. Sixth mm -hmm. grade? Younger. Fifth grade? Sure. Yeah, the we kids, see that. You guys don't allow cell phones in your Waldorf school? No. Nothing. No. So if a kid brings one in, what happens to him? Um, well, <laughs> clean the erasers. Right? I think, yeah, yeah. yeah right. No, we we have it checked in, but uh, <laughs> we even ask the parents to stay off their cell phones when they come onto the school grounds because it is a distraction. Oh my God! It, it, I agree. I'm totally with you on this one. It totally distraction. Okay, real quick. Uh, um, the movie. You guys have a movie. It's this Thursday. Yes. Uh, Screen Agers. What's the movie about? Um, it's a film featuring uh, children and what, how the screens are affecting them. It was done by a physician who's also a parent. So in terms of her uh, practice and um, her children, she wanted to see what the effects were having on children. And they have no attention span. It's not good, right? Right. We're seeing ADHD. We're seeing anxiety. Uh, as I said earlier, we're seeing addiction. So um, the film features that, and there will be a panel discussion afterwards. We're also recognizing that this is a challenge for all of us, and so it's an opportunity for parents to come together and discuss the challenges they're having and other possibilities that they can work with their families. Probably like anything, anything in moderation is probably sure. okay, but these kids these days, oh my gosh, and look, Mario <laughs> is on this thing. She's on it right now. Right now. She's tweeting out stuff. I agree with you. All right. Uh, check out the movie Screen Agers Thursday at the Waldorf School at the school, right? In Indian Village? Correct. Yep. yep. Grades uh, K through 8? Is that it's, right? It's uh, pre-K through 8th grade. 8th grade. Yep. 7 o'clock on Thursday. You can buy tickets at the door or buy them online at our website, DetroitWaldorf.org. And a panel discussion follows. We'll put that information we just did. We'll put it up again, and we'll run it throughout the whole day. All right. Thank you so much. What are we going to do? Oh, I'm going to... Uh, we'll be back in just a moment.